Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in, Alessandro the Crypto here, I hope you're doing all fine. So welcome to this uh, new episode, in today's video we're going to analyze the next potential big move of Bitcoin because we are about to have a big breakout pretty soon. So yesterday we had kind of a fake out, we had here this initial new resistance here at $48,000 and Bitcoin successfully recovered again above this important price level, above the 9 and 20 moving average in the 4 hour and currently we are having this moving average just here in the four hour as a support and also the four hour time frame gave a buy signal here in my own indicator and we had a nice bounce off from the 50 level in the RSI so we are back in this potential rising wedge here or at least in this upwards trending channel we can also adjust now this line here so we have now interior support at around forty six thousand six hundred dollar and the resistance up here at fifty thousand one hundred sixty dollars so on the cme chart and in some other exchanges we reached already 50k so that of course is very bullish for bitcoin and now the big question is of course will we see follow through here towards sixty thousand dollar because if we're gonna see here a breakout out of this upwards trending channel which could end up to be a big bull flag then of course the target is towards 60 K or at least very very close to 60k because if we measure here the potential breakout target from this last move that we had here up to 50k let's say we're gonna break out here you can see that this will take us exactly at 60,000 dollar and then of course we have to see if Bitcoin is able to consolidate here above 60k or if here we're gonna see a blow off top or maybe a big rejection which will take us again towards uh, 40 K potentially even go lower so we have to wait now for a four hour close above this resistance here of 50,000 or maybe a four hour close below the support of $46,500 in order to see where Bitcoin potentially is going to next because the next move in my opinion will be a very huge one probably we're gonna see a move of around $10,000 doesn't matter to the upside or to the downside and keep in mind my friends that if we're gonna see a breakout to the downside and we're gonna retest 40k potentially potentially even down here these 37 to 38 thousand dollar area where also the 200 moving average is lining up in the four hour take it as a good long opportunity and also as a good buy opportunity because bitcoin most likely is gonna bounce again then to the upside we are still looking very bullish in all time frames and that's why it is very important that you take any kind of dip as a good long and buy opportunity even though of course sometimes there are some sell signals but overall bitcoin will go way above one 100k potentially even this year and that's why everything that you're buying below 100k or even better below 60k is a very good entry for the long term doesn't matter if we first maybe come down again to retest 30,000 or maybe even 20,000 dollar because at the end it's only important that you're buying below 100k because sooner or later bitcoin will reach this target and go way higher so in the four hour time frame we are looking quite bullish and I'm expecting here a possible breakout to the upside even though there are still some huge warning signs and we still could get rejected here and have a big fall towards 37 to 40 K but since now we are trending again above the 9 and 20 moving average in the 4 hour we have now again the chance to break out here to the upside the only problem is that we're still not able to close 4 hour candles above the Bollinger Bands so you can see in here in 4 hour that we are still squeezing within this tiny channel in the Bollinger Bands and we should expect a big breakout to the upside or to the downside pretty soon but since we are now trending again on the bullish side of course it is more likely that we're gonna see a breakout to the upside and now we can go over into the biggest warning sign that i have for today my friends this is here the daily time frame we are still very overbought in the rsi we are creating here lower highs in the rsi and we have higher highs in the price 
that is a bearish divergence we also have a confirmed sell signal right now here in my own indicator so the daily time frame suggests that we could see here a possible sell-off at least towards the 20 daily moving average here at 42 000 so that's why i still think there is a chance that maybe we could come down here to retest the 20 daily also confirm this 42 000 dollar area as a new support and then move on towards 60 000 only because we have this bearish divergence in the daily and also i got a confirmed sell signal here in my own indicator of course the momentum is not that huge to the downside here so we just have a little bit of warning signs here and of course this confirmed sell signal so keep in mind if you are in a high leveraged long position right now use a stop loss to lock in profits and don't get liquidated because we still could see here a fall towards these 42 000 dollar again before we move on towards 60 000 dollar so even though i am very bullish and i'm expecting here 60k to be reached within this month i have to give this warning sign that we have some bearish signs as well here especially in the daily time frame and if you're trading with my own indicator over on discord where you can see different time frames for bitcoin usually here we are trading the three hour time frame but once the daily time frame so the bigger time frame is against the three hour time frame so if here we are getting a buy signal but in the daily sell signal then this is not a good sign and you should be very careful if you're opening up right now big long positions because if these two time frames disagree then this is very very risky to trade so that means you should wait at least till we're gonna get another buy signal in the daily and then of course also in the three hour time frame to start longing again with big positions right now it is a bit dangerous my friends and a big shout out to our great crypto trading chat over on discord if you want to join our great discord trading family then make sure to use the official link to our discord trading chat down below here in the video description once you click here the invitation link you have to confirm that you are a human and not a bot you have to go here to read first and click here on thumbs up so you can easily enter the chat and of course if you want to get access to my own indicator live stream here then you can get it for a small donation you just have to contact me here on discord and now my friends let's head over into ethereum because ethereum currently has a very similar situation like bitcoin it looks quite bullish here at least the four hour time frame also here we are trending above the 9 and 20 moving average but overall, I think also Ethereum could be in a similar channel like Bitcoin. This could end up in a big rising wedge, which of course is a bearish pattern, at least for the short term. We could come down again to test the 200 moving average here at $1,480. But if this is now also a bull flag, then of course we're going to see Ethereum go way above $2,000. We can also do here a possible measurement in case that we're going to see a breakout to the upside. Let's say we're going to break out today somewhere here. The measurement here would bring us towards around $2,400 which of course is very likely to be reached for Ethereum because I still think that Ethereum is very undervalued especially compared to the Bitcoin price. So I think Ethereum has a lot to catch up here and it is not a bad idea to diversify also a little bit into Ethereum because if Ethereum is outperforming Bitcoin if we're going to see a big fall in Bitcoin dominance then I think it, with Ethereum you can do some really huge gains not only in terms terms of dollars but also in terms of bitcoin so that means that investing right now in ethereum will bring you potentially even more bitcoin than just buying bitcoin straight away right now so that's why keep in mind also a little bit to diversify into ethereum and also if we go over into the daily time frame here you can see that we are still closing candles above the nine daily moving average yesterday we came a little bit below but immediately this dip was bought back up and as you can see right now we are again gearing up for another big move to the upside hopefully we can also close today above the nine daily moving average here at 1780 this should confirm us that we most likely also here gonna go towards two thousand dollar to retest this resistance and then potentially have a breakout to the upside i think one of the two bitcoin or ethereum is gonna break out to the upside or to the downside first like this we maybe can then estimate what the other one will do as well so if bitcoin or ethereum is going to break out first then of course you can trade the other asset over on bybit or femex for example like this you should be able to do some nice gains so also ethereum in my opinion could see a breakout here to the upside but also here keep in mind there are also some bearish signs even here in the daily we are very overbought 
in my own indicator we also got several days ago a sell signal here and the momentum right now is shifted to the downside so also here big warning signs we could come down again towards this $1,500 area potentially even go a little bit lower towards $1,300 but overall if we're gonna see such a dip in Ethereum and Bitcoin make sure to buy as much as possible because these kind of dips you must buy during an uptrend we are still far away from a new cycle top and that's why it is very important that you are still accumulating as much ethereum and bitcoin as possible during this bull market and we can also have a quick look into the bitcoin dominance because we are still bouncing here from this important support at 60 percent so here's still nothing new let's wait here in the next coming hours and days what will happen i'm still expecting here a bounce to the upside and that of course is very bullish for the bitcoin price so most likely we're going to see the biggest show next upcoming in bitcoin Bitcoin and not in some altcoins and if we go over into the DXY here you can see the most bearish chart in the world we are still trending below all the moving averages in the daily we are now losing also the 50 daily moving average as a support so that is very very bearish for the DXY and I'm expecting to go at least straight down towards 89 and that of course is very very bullish for the crypto market also for the stock market of course and that's why I'm I'm still more bullish than bearish for the breakout to the upside in the Bitcoin price and also in the Ethereum price because we have the DXY falling off the cliffs here again and that of course will fire up even more bullish momentum for the crypto market especially for Bitcoin and if you want to take as much gains as possible on the way to the upside here towards 60k make sure that you have an account ready over on Bybit and Femex to trade this breakout if you still need an account use my referral links down below here for the recommended exchanges with those exchanges you will also get some extra money if you use my sign up link and also if you don't want to trade yourself with leverage try out Primex PT because with my link you can sign up without KYC also you can use this special promo codes here to get less fees and extra deposit bonus so like this there you can do copy trading you can just copy trade other successful traders like this you can also profit a lot if you catch the right traders and you don't have to trade yourself so try it out my friends all the recommended links are down below here also if you're new in the crypto space make sure to use Swissborg, Binance and Coinbase to buy cryptos with my referral links you will get some extra money and also some free cryptos especially here on Coinbase we still have some slots free to claim some free band protocol Stellar or Cheat EOS and so on and if you do a first purchase with my sign up links here then of course you can get up to 100 dollar or euro in bonus so you will get some extra money so you can buy even more cryptos so with that said guys i'm gonna wrap it up for now let's see where we're gonna see the next big move i think we're gonna see it potentially in the next coming hours latest at the end of this week but a big move will come the four hour time frame is screaming now for a big move to come and i still think we're gonna see a potential move here to the upside pretty soon but keep in mind that we still have some warning signs that we also could see a potential sell-off here so thank you again very much for watching my friends don't forget to hit that like button if you like the content subscribe to the channel i do daily ta videos and we're gonna see us all in the next one bye